age than this guy and probably alt right click let's go to edge section mode and hit alt right click age alt right click age and alt right click age and alt right click age now let's go to uh, wireframe mode and try to select all pin B like so, B like so. Okay. Mm Actually, you know what? Now that I'm thinking, on, oh, thinking about it, we can just go ahead and select this guy and hit P selection, Alt H R to reveal all, and actually do not care, like at all. Origin. Origin to geometry and um, let's fix this guy. Actually, no, let's <laughs> let's not tweak it. Let's just assign our material and let's get on with that. So, about that and probably some, you know, red. Yep. And thickness 0 0.5 and preview and I add looks okay and this guy will be metal metal yeah there it is metal and aluminum okay let's go to the settings and I always use external sample uh, sample traditional CPU with Lux render GUI, choose your positive Lux render. Don't uh, check it, no light groups. Uh, sample a metalopolis, surface integrated bi directional. Basically, the rest thing, uh, all, all the settings looks fine. So, let's hit Control S once again, let's hit F12 and see what happens. Okay, we see it's, it's doing some of the magic, alright. So yep, yeah, uh, then we can see our glass, our our umbrellas looks uh, uh, look like, um, a little bit too mm, bright. Let's actually hop over to clean the estimate settings and let's play around with the lights. Oh, let's probably crank up left. Oh, crank up left, crank up. Why don't I have the right? Okay, I'll probably have to add this. Front. Front looks okay. Okay, um, oh, probably we can add some drama if we add some tint to our left and, uh, and right color. But basically, what I see now is our, our, our velvet is um, a, a little bit too blown out. So, what I want to do is I want to go back to our velvet material and oh that's why it's blown out because it's half thickness of one and a ridiculous orange light actually it's not orange it's somehow pink so orange Well, it's hard to find orange, you know? Well, that'd be like this, this type of material. Well, 0 0.5 on our thickness. And let's add some drama to our lights. Uh, so this one will be left. This one is right. So emission color, let's, uh, let's go with uh, color temperature blue. and. This guy, let's go with a tint of yellowish. Like so. And let's just for now lift our uh, front and back lights that they are. Hit 0, hit F12. To render. 
and see what happens. Uh, okay. Now let's play without lights, so crank up right just a touch. I can't find my, my left light for some reason. It was right before, now it's left. Probably have to dash those. Uh, probably do you have to oh, detach those lights oh, from each other. Because probably right now they are one object. Actually, no, this one is right. This one is right as well. I don't get it. Probably it's because they share the same material, so let's hit lead on this guy. Let's hit new. Uh, no and uh, emission. This one will be blue. This guy is orange, right? Yeah, this is right. Uh, this actually ha uh, has to be left, and this guy has to be right, just like so. Well, let's again control S and hit F12. Now we must see our, our two lights in, 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 in our. Uh, Light groups, yep, seems like we do have our left light and our right light. And just uh, they add a little bit, uh, a little bit more interest to the, to the whole scene. Okay. Okay, um, looks nice, looks nice. Uh, now I want to uh, add some texture on my umbrella and uh, the I uh, uh, will uh, have to uh, unwrap uh, this umbrella. And let me show you how you, <laughs> you unwrap the umbrella. Uh, actually, let me just add one more thing. Like, let's add a loop cut here, and let's add a loop cut here. So, the umbrella has my thickness to it, and probably add a loop cut over here as well so the umbrella is kind of sick and nice not this like uh anyhow let's basically go to edge selection mode let's alt shift right click alt shift right click and let's hide the spin for the time being and actually what What we can see now is, uh, if, if we go to the more view, we can probably select those edges as well. Yep, we can. And the guys here, no, control Z, Alt Shift, right click, and yep, like so. And you'll probably notice that we have like uh, some something going there but anyhow let's hit control e and make a actually no not make edge face let's hit control e and hit mark scene then let's go to the face mode select all u and wrap now let's split our screen uh, here let's go to our uh, uv image editor image New image. Okay. Ah, uh, yeah, I know it's not the best in wrap, but hey, uh, it might be stretched just a little bit. But basically, what you know, uh, what we want to do is we want to uh, save this guy out and apply some uh, texture on it. Um, I, w I wanted to uh, be those umbrellas uh, Chinese, not because they're like cheap. And made in China instead of it because uh, uh, I wanted to put some uh, nice Chinese symbols on it. So uh, I'll just 